Hello YouTube, this is Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales, and welcome back to the Wales campaign. So, in the previous episode, Melior Maid Z won a great battle here, around about Lincoln. He pushed out, beat an army back, and he's now going to head towards Nottingham and raise Nottingham yes, to the ground, hopefully. To crush the enemy. Meanwhile, in other parts of the campaign, Edwin Riddirk is going to head towards Oxford and try and raise that to the ground. King Llewellyn is planning for the future. We have a garrison of Gwent Raiders that's going to go to Gloucester to help reinforce that. And we have Mardi down here who's going to try and raise the coasts as well. So we've got plenty of things going on in the campaign. And we've done really well. We've consolidated our kind of our kind of lands. It's only really Lincoln, but that's because we pushed out and we didn't really... We don't really care about it, so, you know. <laughs> anyway, Prince David, you are maintaining your siege. Hopefully we can defeat them, Lancaster. There's a captain nearby, don't know what he's going to do, but we have got men on the way to help Chester if we do lose Chester, so there we go. My diplomat, where is he? He's up here, heading towards the Norwegians. Ooh, Captain Lilluk, what are you doing, dude? My diplomat's going to head towards the Norwegian town up here, Norwegian castle of Wick. And yeah, I think we can probably end the turn. This is the previous video's end of turn, so... Without further ado, let's click the end turn button. Huzzah! And England didn't attack us. Wow. Okay, end of turn report. And we got some profit, which is good. What was this? Civil disorder? Lincoln and Gloucester. Right, we kind of expected this, so let's get that garrison into Gloucester quickly. That will help. Surely I can repair the drill square as well. Oh my god, why does this cost so much money? Can we retrain these guys, which I will do. For some florins. I'm going to head towards Oxford with this By army. Will, because I can. As you command, my Construction dear. report. And trade to decrease. Rodri the honest cruel leader. Oh, okay. And then we have this army now which is going to go towards. Command, we're going to go to the fort first. Because it would be very smart to go into the fort. We're then going to push towards Nottingham itself. Oh look at that. Nottingham. Them, Let's raise Nottingham to the ground. The Ugh. And there's five units here. Edmund, the coward that he is, ran from the last battle. We've weakened him to 11 men. We'll take Nottingham. Lincoln, on the other hand. Oh my goodness. We need to get some troops in here quickly, don't we? Oh, I can only get a merchant as well. Uh, I didn't think of this, did I? Give them, if I give them low taxes in Lincoln, that might persuade them. Command me, sire. I've got enough movement points for anyone else. Where my spy you, needs to go up here. With discretion, sir. And that's why. <laughs> I knew he was here somewhere. Anselm of Bapton, who have yet to fight. He's been the guy that's eluded me this whole campaign. And he hasn't actually fought me yet. But he looks like he's turned around to go back to either to this fort or to attack me. But without further ado, let's attack Lancaster. Oh, look at that, Lancaster. Let's take Lancaster. Oh, come on. Lancaster. Oh, my goodness. Captain Toby. 173 versus 509. The prince himself, Prince David. I don't know what to resolve this, because it's actually in their favour. So I'm going to fight this battle, the Battle of Lancaster, part two. I Here we go, guys. Lancaster. Battle, oh, let's have a quick drink while it's loading. Ah, oh, man. Oh, this campaign's been fantastic. Oh. So enthusiastic over it. Here we go, right. We've got a couple of siege equipments. Must bash down the guide, so let's get this thing into position. Let's get this one into position, and let's get this one into position. I actually got the bill men there, so that's good. Right, need to think of a strategy now, so let's get all the bows. All the bows must get selected. Merci beaucoup. Get them into a decent position where they can reinforce. Cavalry, Prince David can be there. Spearmen grouped up, ready. Ready and waiting. They can be behind, ready to attack. And I have some more cavalry which can go there. Cavalry can be grouped up with the general, and I think then we are okay. Gwent Raiders can chuck them in the front. Let's go and attack them. Do they have units on the walls? I believe they do. Let's actually fight them. Armored sergeants, I'm going to get all the bows to aim. They should get some kills to weaken them. Don't forget, we do outnumber them, and the balance of power in the bottom left corner is actually in our our um, favour. So, that's what we're going to do. 
<coughs> pardon me. Oh my goodness, what is going on? Why aren't you pushing your thingy over there? You naughty, naughty people. Once I get to that gate, we should be fine. We're actually going to get these English billmen. It's quite ironic that we're using English billmen to, to destroy the English. 60 versus 56, but we are going to get some kills, I think. Oh. Yeah, we should get some kills on them. I'm just trying to get them to, to, to be distracted as I march these rams towards the gates. Get them both up there. Oh, look at that. Look at that, man. Look at that. Look at that. Get up there. Charge! Kill him. Get your asses up there. Look at that dude climb. Holy shit. What a nice bum. What a nice bum. Holy crap. Get up there, man. Arrows are flying in and they're not doing any kills. Oh, they killed one. Good. I'm thankful they killed one. <laughs> oh, man. Right. What do we have left? We have Gwent Raider, sure. We have one Gwent Raider just hiding amongst the arrows. Militiamen are going to be going in with the uh, Felwyr Heavy Infantry, which I'm glad about. They have Armoured Swordsmen there, so those two units can deal with them. Meanwhile, why can't I select these guys? Oh my god, what's going on? It's just... Where are my men going? Oh my god, is it glitching? Oh, they're getting up there now. Attack! Get in there and kill them. There we go, get in there and kill them, that's what we want. We want blood. Fire and blood. Come on. Oh, look at that. That's excellent. We're going to get some kills, hopefully. The bill men can do their job. And we are actually in a position to be ramming the gates. Oh, no. Look at that. That's not fair. Just batter it. Come on. Don't want the boiling oil. Ram it. Ram the gates. I think it's glitching. No. Don't do this to me. <laughs> what the fuck? It's not even opening the gates. Oh, it's not fair. She didn't. Oh, it's, it's working now. 12% damage. That'll do. How are we doing up here? My billmen have... Oh my god, they've ran. You cowards. They killed one person. That's not fair. <laughs> I hate the... F I hate sieges. My god. All right, I'm going to get into this. We're going to get these heavy billmen. Heavy billmen. Heavy... Uh, Axemen into a good position. The Gwent Raiders can get their asses up there as well. So we have three units to attack there. Time to send the spearmen up as well. So let's get these spearmen. The oh, look at that. We're in. Hell yeah. Now is the time for send the one man, the, the one Gwent Raider in quickly. <laughs> oh my god. Let's charge the armored sergeant. Charge. Gwent Raider, you can just go up and attack these dudes on the wall. And we're just going to send everything in now, so my arrows can continue to pepper. We can actually aim up there. The cavalry must get in. The spearmen must get in. Oh, look at the Welsh militiamen are charging in first. The, ca the, the idiots that they are. They're no match for the armoured sergeants. Are they? What? My heavy entries ran. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> Fucking hell. It's not fair, is it? These siege defenses. They actually. Lancaster's very hard to take in this campaign. They've proven to be the one building which has eluded me so far. Even though I outnumber them, I have. Well, I'm in a diff difficult kind of position to take it. Oh my god, I can't send cavalry into spearmen. No. What am I doing? Guys, get away, you fucking idiots. This way. Fucking hell. Dudes, this way. Get your asses over here quick. That's right. We just provide a distraction so they can get the charges in on them. That works. That works relatively well. And I want to try and take the capture point with my cavalry, I think. So let's go down here. Because they have nothing in the settlement, and it's probably the best way I'm going to take the settlement. So it looks like they have everything at the front anyway. We're just going to hold up like so. Welsh well, Mishman come back. That's good. The arrows. The their worth today. Aim for the, the spearmen a bit. Oh, they have armored swordsmen the attacking me from there. If we Shit. remain true and steadfast, victory will be ours. Cavalry can come down here and into the capture point. That way, we will be outflanking them. 
Last mission man could charge there. And the spears and the arrows and shit can get into a decent position to fight them. We're gonna hold them for as long as we can there. Cavalry's waiting. What's when a unit of cavalry can actually charge them in the rear? Why my general can actually take the capture point. There we go. Doing this the hard way, I think. My lord, our men are in command of the castle. We're in command. Three minutes to go. Shit, it's gonna be awkward. Charge! Look at that one cavalry man in there, like a beast, like an absolute beast. <laughs> I'm actually going to form a Shieldtron with one of these. Because it might actually help me come surrounded. We're going to do it with both of them, I think. Shieldtron would be useful right now. The thing is, this armoured sergeant's probably going to charge me. They have spearmen, that's all they have, spearmen. And I'm not really in a position to deal with spearmen. Unfortunately, where are these guys going? Right, they're not attacking me, they ask good. I've actually formed this nice little Shiltron here, but one of my troops are routed, unfortunately. If they attack the Shiltron, though, they are going to be in trouble. Oh, and they're actually going to charge my general, I think. Oh my god, don't. No, it's not fair. No, I want to take the settlement. No, it's not fair. <laughs> Why won't you let me take it? Alright, what well, they have? They have 54 heavy infantry and 57. Armoured swordsman would be the best one to charge. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. I can't charge him. Get away from him. I'm actually going to flank around and take the spearmen from the side while they're tied up with my shieldrons. Meanwhile, all my bows. Our men no longer command the castle. My bows can the continue to fire upon the spearmen there. True and steadfast, victory will be ours. We're going to have to do it this way, I think. Oh, actually. Actually, they've let, allowed me a chance to flank them. Right, the bows. Get into the castle, please. My spearmen need to not rout. Right, watch this. Don't try this at home, kids. They're going to camp there. My bow is going to camp and hit them. Meanwhile, my general has got a nice little run up for a charge. And I can actually charge them in the rear, so let's watch this now. We're in the shield drawn. General for a charge in the rear. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit, 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 shit. 24, 20. Oh, my God, we're doing well. Down to 14 in one charge. 12. That little Shiltron trick with the, the enemy general. Has no honor. Oh, yes. Our men have captured the enemy general. Yes, hell yeah. Winning the battle. If we continue like this, Fuck yeah. We'll the Captain enemy. Toby is no more. Oh, my goodness. Right. There's only one left. Right, they're gone. General, form up. This is how we play it. Spear units. This would be the way to do it. Get the spearmen out to Shieldron. And into a formation in front of my general. Meanwhile, I have ammunition to burn with my bow units. And that is exactly what they're going to do. I have a nice defensive wall in front of my general. This is how I'm going to take Lancaster. They're going to be there. They're going to take hits. Hopefully. We live in hope. Right. Just picking sure they're all there. Yes, they are. There we go, we're getting kills. We're getting kills, I think. 54. 56 and 54. Remember that, 56, 54. Let's bring the spearmen forward slightly. Let's actually put them into a nice formation. Nice little blanket formation if I can. Like so. That works well. Yeah, that works well, I think. And then... Oh my god. <laughs> Things you do to win battles in this game. And they are going to come out and charge me, I think. The swordsman I can charge is the spearmen. The armoured sergeants I need to be careful of. Don't think we're killing as many as we hope, are we? I never meant to start a war. Just wanted you to let me in. 
Form Shiltron. Form Shiltron. Might have to go for a charge. A little bit of a charge. Right, Spearman have gone that side. Charge the heavy infantry. Hopefully the Shiltrons can hold. Just dangerous the way I'm playing this. Very dangerous. Don't try this at home. That wasn't even a good charge. Get our general in there quickly. Get in there, you fool! I'm gonna push my general through. Prince Davis. Oh, the Prince of Wales! Holy shit, the spearmen are out in. Get them quickly. Oh my god, the Prince of Wales. Beasting. Yes! Pursue Kill them all. Them We've done it. Right, you guys can actually stop firing. Just run over there or something. The general. It's gonna kill them all. Fast forward. There we go, lovely. I think we've done it. That'll do. Oh man, this clear victory, one victory. remaining, Captain Toby. To we actually captured the general as well, so a very good victory there. We're going to ransom, look at that value, 909. Oh, they rejected again. Lancaster is ours for the taking. Hell yeah. Victory. Prince Nothing David, the Prince of Wales. I'm going to fucking victory. exterminate them, look at that. Get that money, get that money, get that money. Lancaster exterminated and the army has routed. Resistance is futile and a trait decreased. He's not a fair in rule. Of course he's not. We kill them all, winning first. And a trait increase, proven commander, plus three. Oh my god. Absolutely love that. Carlisle is up there. That's for the taking as well, I think. We have another fort here we can probably take as well. And what we're we going to do here? We need to retrain. I can't afford it at the moment. We can't do it yet. Ballista maker. Oh, I could get one of them, maybe. Port. Um, there are things we can do here. I'm not going to do these things yet, though. I need to be careful of Anselm of Bacton. Sire. Now, I'm thinking he's probably going to try and take Chester, so what I'm going to do My lord. My lord. is send Sire. some Sire. heavy lord. units to Chester. As you wish. And probably take to them, 28 of them as well. Half a stack gives us a better chance you are weaker than I. of defending ourselves you. there. Shrewsbury, oh my god, Shrewsbury could be lost. Edwin, Reduc is going to go and attack will, there. We shall could we do anything in Shaftesbury yet? We can recruit, oh, we can recruit some decent units here. And I think we are going to be recruiting units. Um, or oh, we can retrain actually, let's retrain both of these instead. And then we will recruit some Erinite spearmen and some English billmen. The king must have a good army, so we must do that. Mardi. Gonna go past this fort. Yes, my liege. George, English merchant. Two English merchants. With I have a merchant honor, somewhere. Sire. Where's my merchant to? Camp here, Where sire. is my merchant? I do have a merchant. I think I've been using him as a spy, actually. Spy. Ah, there he is. At your service. Carrigan. Oh. Arundel. English castle. Oh, these castles are so undefended. I wish I had a big, massive army. Journey I can just take them all out. Um, right, my merchant's gonna go to the south Christus. in that case. I am a diplomat in the north. Where is he? He's going towards Norway. Sire. Without question, sire. Yes, sire. Head towards Tomorrow's the Norwegian castle up there. Out, sire. And we are doing extremely well. Let's have a quick look at this map. Look at that. Only a few. Well, let's see. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Probably ten regions England have, and we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We are 50-50 more or less at the moment. This war is 50-50 and we're doing fantastically well. Oxford will sh will fall shortly. Whatever's down here will fall in Cornwall. And I think we will probably be on our way. Uh, Montgomery, I think I need to use some of these troops in Montgomery. The thing is, they are going to be... Oh, Let's take four of them out and put them in Shrewsbury instead. Montgomery is disillusioned, so is Canadavon. To counteract this, we will be recruiting some...
peasants because it will help the public order or at least it should do can't get them here unfortunately but we can get ballista and catapult so let's get let's get two catapults in montgomery they can be used and we can build a nice big army to help in my attack on yes. my attack with it. we have this lovely little sire. siege that we're going to have at nottingham as well so the thing is these big sire. english armies in the center they've been pulled ragged because they didn't know where i was going i went to lincoln i took that they didn't know where i was going i went to nottingham took that i've now taken lancaster as well they don't know what i'm going to do and that's been the plan so far um I kept that on low tax rate in case they do rebel. Unfortunately, I got no troops to to leave there, so I'm just gonna have to hope that it doesn't rout or doesn't doesn't rebel. I should say. I think we're probably in a decent enough position. Just gonna get the lines of sight going. I think we got a clear clear run to Oxford. That's gonna go in the next part, and Winchester will soon follow. So it'll be one, two, three. If I take this one down here. With, as long as there's not a big army waiting for me, I don't lose. That's another three, and they've only got really. I think they've got one, two, three, four, five. I think or six maybe settlements left. So it's not, it's not going too, too badly at the moment. It's going very well, and we're only on turn twelve as well. So we've we've been really quick in this campaign, and we're just dominating everything at the moment. But I think I'm going to end this episode here. I have been Dragonheart, the Prince of Wales. Thank you for watching. Until next time, goodbye.